Have you ever wondered about the health risks associated with mosquitoes and ticks? This is a topic that demands attention given the significant public health issues these pests pose. The purpose of this discussion is to delve into the intricacies of mosquito and tick control, providing insights on effective strategies to maintain a pest-free environment. Let's start by understanding these pests better. Mosquitoes and ticks are more than just annoying, they are carriers of diseases, some of which can be life-threatening. The life cycle and habitats of these pests make them especially hard to control. Mosquitoes breed in standing water and ticks thrive in warm, humid environments. They can transmit a variety of diseases, including malaria, dengue, Lyme disease and more. Environmental control strategies play a key role in managing mosquito and tick populations. This involves eliminating breeding sites such as stagnant water bodies for mosquitoes and tall grasses for ticks. Insecticides and biological control methods can also be effective. However, it's crucial to use these methods responsibly to avoid harming the environment and non-target species. Personal protection measures are equally important. Wearing appropriate clothing and gear can provide a physical barrier against these pests. Insect repellents can also be highly effective when used safely. It's important to read and follow the instructions on the product label to ensure safe and effective use. There are times when professional pest control services may be needed, especially when infestations become too large to manage individually. These services have access to a wider range of control methods and can provide a comprehensive solution. It's important to choose a reputable service as poorly executed pest control can do more harm than good. Community-wide efforts can also make a significant difference in controlling mosquito and tick populations. By working together, communities can implement large-scale control measures that are more effective than individual efforts. There are numerous examples of such successful programs that have significantly reduced the prevalence of these pests. In conclusion, controlling mosquitoes and ticks is a multifaceted task that involves understanding these pests implementing environmental control strategies, taking personal protection measures, and potentially seeking professional help. Community involvement can also greatly enhance these efforts. Remember, a proactive approach to mosquito and tick control can help prevent diseases and create a more comfortable living environment. Now, you might still have questions like, what are the most common diseases spread by mosquitoes and ticks? How can I safely use insect repellents on children? Are there natural methods for controlling mosquitoes and ticks? What are the signs that a professional pest control service is needed? Or how can communities work together to control mosquito and tick populations? These are all important queries, and the answers to these will help you better prepare and protect yourself and your community from these pests.